That's right, welcome to Tybalt's Apprentice. And if I sound a little off, it's because I have a head cold. That's right, I managed to get sick two days before Christmas. Yay! Anyhow, here's my Christmas gift to you. That comes to you by way of... <clears throat> excuse me. It comes to you by way of MTG Arena Original Decks. And uh, so this is a net deck, if you will but it's just too good not to share. I will include a link to his original deck and his videos, which are far better than mine. So why are you wasting your time here? Who would follow anybody named Tibble's Apprentice anyhow? Uh, at any rate, here we go. We are going with Life Gaining Angels, and you can see it uh, pretty much runs itself. Uh, you've got, uh, well, you see a lot of angels getting shot down, a lot of creatures getting shot down right away, but that's okay couple of enchantments on the board as well as some angels in the sky and uh we're sure to get an easy victory here right right not like that um okay so this is uh this is maybe not the best way to start off the video but i try to show you videos that are unblemished that means wins and losses as they come and um we're on a downhill slope right now, so getting this on the board isn't going to do anything. Putting this on the board might help and might give me some flyers after they destroy the creatures, except he's probably going to get picked off right away too, right? Maybe not. Maybe they've used their burn stuff, but I'm not going to be a sucker and block that. Yeah, there we go. I didn't really think they were out of burn spells. And those, uh, yeah, ouch. Important to uh well you have a chance against aggro you just have to be patient this deck uh as you can see i'm down to 11 life but i've got a flyer up somebody with a big butt and uh that can matter not when you're getting minus one minus one counters though but they're going in for the kill they've got me down to eight uh this i'm i'm gonna have to stem the bleeding a little bit here and with that, I think, getting this on the board. Um, so pumping mana through it to get a couple of things out. Let's get this out. And um, I really don't want to swing in. And they don't really want to play the game anymore. And I'm okay with that. They evidently ran out of gas. I will take that win. We will not count that towards our total, though. Um, doesn't really feel like I earned that. Of course, that just could be the cough medicine talking. I don't know. Anyhow, we're on to another game. Uh, again, these are all cards that you have seen, not really utilizing anything new or specific. It's just life gain. This is something that I haven't played with a lot. But, I mean, I've played a lot of playing life gain. I haven't played the, the that angel right there. Uh, so put this on the board, and we'll put this, since we've got multiples of them. And... Um, and we'll get shot down there too. Uh, aggro seems to be key here. A lot of the stuff I'm playing in various formats are aggro, of course. So uh, we'll put that second one down. Hope that that one sticks. Um, again, I don't really expect it to. Um, you know, I'd say I don't expect it because I've played this already, but I, I don't really know what I'm doing at this point. Uh, I'm not going to say I'm high on cough medicine, but I've had a lot of day quill today and still managed to sleep for three hours straight. So anyhow, there's that. We're moving. Yeah, man, they are just getting picked off left and right. If left, right, and center. Jeez. Oh, that's not good. All right. Our only advantage here is that they're going to be playing. They played out most of the removal. They're going to be playing creatures. And uh, I can gain a life off of that at least. Uh, if I can stay slightly above, if I can just keep my head above water, we'll go from 22 up to 23, swing in for a little bit of damage. They can hit me for 10 if I let them, and I do. So let's uh, let's see what we can do. Let's bring this down. Um, and, oh, we get a bonus there. So, yeah. Okay, back up to 33. That's a nice even number. It's not really even. It's divisible by three, though. Ah, uh, again, I apologize for this. I'm I'm maybe a little loopy. All right, ten damage. Down to uh, twenty-eight is what I think we're going to be at. Uh, they've got plenty of cards in hand. 
All right, let's let's go ahead and block though. I will block. See that eats one of them. They're down to seven. I think the aerial assault is just going to be too great. Never, ever, ever underestimate evasion. Um, that's poss possibly why I'm I'm lazy and I play lots of board wipes. I don't think it was being lazy. I think it's the best way to. Well, that game's over. All right, so we're on a roll. That one we played through, got a little bit of damage in, took a lot of damage. I'm going to count that one. Let's do it again, though. Let's see if we can do it again. In the meantime, if you're looking for any cards, be sure to stop by Dark Ritual on TCG Player. Just do a search for sellers. You can always punch in Dark Ritual. I'm the one in California. Um, and yeah, enough about that. Nobody cares. Let's move on to the next game. Can I win again? Uh, looks pretty good with those two those two out on the first and second turn anytime they drop something okay they're going to be going not necessarily wide but over the top but let's put that down so if we get removal put that down so we can start making our own angels if we need to how fast and how hard are they going to hit me uh not very okay so they're going to swing in i don't plan on filling up or letting anything go to the graveyard Maybe they have a plan that's going to send my stuff to the graveyard. I'm not worried about it. All right, let's get this on the board and get it indestructible as fast as we can, though. I think that's the key here. And uh, mm. and I'm not sure how that works because that's uh, damage can't be prevented. Uh, however, I'm at 27 life, so that's that's easily can be absorbed, right? As long as they don't have any other shenanigans. And I think dropping, getting this... I've got two plays here. Let's put all the counters on here. Again, try to get that up to indestructible. Or or not. <laughs> or we'll just take that win and move on to the next game. Hope you guys are having a lovely Christmas Eve. Um, I'm actually filming this, recording it, putting it out, all in the matter of, well, in a matter of minutes, you could probably tell. Sorry about the poor quality. At any rate, uh, yeah, so we're up against elves now. Elves go wide strategy. Works well with, uh, with me gaining life every time something heats the battlefield. However, they are going to have, uh, they are going to have a, a way of stopping me by putting down creatures with reach. And they are off to the races, building as big, a wide army as they possibly can. Um, and yep, there's that, uh, there's that elf that blocks flyers, but let's put this on the board now. Let's go ahead, throw this in. So I get big value when angels come online and I think they are still going to be able to hit me when they get their crater hoof out. It's a standard elf deck. Nothing you haven't seen before. Nothing that I haven't played before. So with that, okay, they are playing their all their elf lords out well i'm okay with that for now all right let's drop this this uh we need much mana as we can get six mana is fine let's uh, get this down first that way we're sure to gain life plenty of life double up my life and uh we'll do this all right we're up to 42 that's a good high number that has vigilance so there's the block but they're not going to have a lot of those. However, one crater hoof at this point is not coming in. I like it. All right, so keep. So I've got one creature. I'd feel better if I had more of those out. But they are down to zero cards in hand, which lets me know they're going to top deck. All right. Never mind. Let's block. Uh, one solid hit over the top will kill them so I don't mind risking losing everything here. Let's make sure everything's blocked. And just in case I've got a soul warden backing me up. And that should be game right there, yeah? Yeah boy. Nice. Okay. So uh that's the deck. That's it. Uh we'll take a quick look at it. Um, definitely I'd say S tier play. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I say play this at home though. Build it up if you got it. Uh, easy victories. Maybe that's not the kind of game you're looking to play though. 
Uh, there are a couple cards we never got to see. We never got to see the Teferi's Protection, or we never got to see that, just in case uh, as backup plans. But really, that's it. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll talk to you next year. Have a happy Christmas.